uh, we hear the Muslims try to present themselves as religious uh, believe who believe in something conservative. What people think about Islam, usually, it's far away from what Islam is about. This Muslim, he said here in the text, He is saying, not like your girls are prostitute. My friend, prostitution is halal in the Quran. And the prostitution is forbidden in the Bible. So let us get you busted as we start. If we go in the Quran, you see, when a Muslim he speak, we are not prostitute like your daughters. He is just a liar because the prostitution is legally, officially halal in Islam. Let us go and see. The Quran have a specific verse and only one verse about al bagha which means prostitution. Chapter 24, which is a chapter of prostitution, say the following. And let those who find not the mean of marrying abstain till God in reach them of his bounty those your right hand owned I mean this translation is weird this translation of who read and laugh this verse is made because a lot of Muslims they open pimp houses and business was booming Muslim women they start complaining that the husband is not even sleeping with them no more because there's a lot of beautiful women in town who they are kidnapped from their family and their husband and they are forced into prostitutions. So Muhammad, he cannot make his men angry and he don't want to look like he is a pimp too. But look what he did. Constrain not your slave girls to prostitution if they desire to live in a chastity. <laughs> Do you see the legalizing of prostitution? So you bring you bring a prostitute, you say to her, and she is your slave girl, she have no she she she's not free anyway to accept or not to accept. I mean she is your slave. She is literally your slave. And then you say, force not your girls to do prostitution if they desire chastity. According to Islam, a man who owns a slave, he can exchange slaves for sex, which means if you have a nice slave and I have a nice slave, I, I am bored with my sex slave. So I can exchange my slave with you. But now this is different level of prostitution. You can rent a woman for sex. And this woman is a slave, which means the one who get paid is the owner, not the slave girl. The slave girl is just a slave. She herself is owned by the owner. So look what Muhammad he said. Are you there, the Abdul, who said we are not the same as your women, prostitute? This is who you are. Show me a verse in the Bible that says you can do prostitution. So now if we find a Muslim, he owns slaves and he is using them for prostitution, the Quran says to him, force not your girls to do prostitution if they desire chastity. So if she agree, it's it's 100% halal. You want to you go, go to Egypt, my friend. Go to Egypt, go to Tunisia, go to Morocco, go to Algeria. Emirat, Kuwait, Saudi Arabia, they ban women from Tunisia, from Morocco, from Algeria to come if they don't have a man with them. And you know why. Egyptian Muslim men, they marry four prostitutes. They go to Mecca. They open a pimp house. And because now the husband is with them, so men can come in and come get out. Do I need to remind you of the prostitution company, which is called the limousine in Saudi Arabia? In Saudi Arabia, after many years of operation, the Saudi government, they have no choice but to shut down a limousine company because this limousine company became so big to the point became so much like, impossible to hide what they do. You call the limousine if you are a girl or a boy, it doesn't matter. If you are a woman, you want a boy, you tell them what kind of a driver you like. You want him from Bosnia as an example, a blonde guy with the blue eyes. Or you want in the limousine a girl from Al Bosnia who is a blonde and she is beautiful. And the sex will be done in the limousine. Now, I'm not going to judge Islam by what Muslims do. I will judge Islam by Islam. Because it's still not everyone, you know, I mean, people do things. You know what I mean? I don't want to judge Muhammad by a Muslim who opened a pimp company. This is not the right way to do it. But as you see, this is Quran.